Hello here! Welcome back to my channel. Today um, I have another toy related video. So I know that's quite a lot, but I'm really deep into toy collecting, like especially my little pony currently. That's why this is another one. This is another um, pony haul, pony mail, or um, like you know, there are a lot of packages over there. And that's kind of fun for me to open them together with you. So, um, yeah, uh, one announcement that I have to make is that, um, not really an announcement, probably this video goes up way until people have discovered it, but just so you know, um, I have created an Instagram account just for everything that's like toy collection related. Because like I have my normal Instagram account, which is like for cosplay and for mostly for cosplay <laughs> and some like normal things in my life um, but as I don't want to bother all the people that are following me for my like Star Wars or cosplay stuff uh, bothering them with like toy pictures but I still want to do them so I created another account um, which is called Lao Sky Painter Toys I will definitely link that down below and um, I will always when I upload a video that is toy related make a post over there so then you can um, if you want to comment on that because you can't comment here on YouTube on toy related videos um, because I have to mark them as like made for children although I don't make them for children but whatever and um, then you can go to there and comment there I will see those comments there and then I will be happy that people uh, that I know that people are watching those because Obviously those toy related videos are getting the least amount of um, views because no one finds them. Anyways, I still want to make those videos so um, let's start with the pony haul or with... Um, yeah, it's, it's, I think it's mostly ponies, there's just one other thing uh, in between. Um, let's start with this one. There's obviously not a pony in there, you can probably tell, but it's related to ponies. In one of the last hauls that I um, showed you, I um, told you that I wanted to buy um, pony hair. Like last time that I bought pony hair um, was from America, um, from um, dollyhair.com. And obviously I don't want to um, buy things from overseas concerning all that shipping stuff that's going on currently. Um, so that's why I um, was searching for pony hair from um, like for example from the UK. This one's from the UK, it's called Dolly, uh, not Dolly, it's <laughs> Retro, Retro Dolls uh, UK and um, they're not really f like, um, they have like more hair, like I think focus on like dolls in general, so um, they don't have like specifically, specifically listed like pony hair, uh, but I know that pony hair is, um, is nylon hair, so that's why I bought from there and I bought ah, a beautiful color of rainbow. So interesting, what is all of this? I don't remember which colors I bought. Obviously I bought, I think two colors which seem to be um, matching. Oh, here it is, by the way. Retro dolls. Um, that are meant to be like um, pony hair colors that are common like the light pink and a darker pink but then I just bought ones that I really thought are like cool that I could use and um, I have this really cool yellow one. Ah, oh, that's very nice because I didn't know which shade of red I wanted I wanted to, to have red pony hair then I have this like minty color and ooh, that's that's red because that's really um, that's neon. That's neon orange. Okay, I like neon. I actually wanted this to be a little bit more like normal neon, uh, normal neon, normal orange. So I can't use that for the project that I'm working on. But I'm pretty sure if I get myself some other uh, neon hair, I just might order again from her, from them, and then. Um, but this is a good uh, start for me, yes. And I have two other uh, colors, which are a uh, white one and a blue one from the previous haul. Okay, this was the pony hair. 
And now let's get into the ponies or the toys. Let's see. I just start with one package. I hope I have pre-opened them better than the last time. Okay. Speaking of neon orange, ooh, this is Sea Breeze. I'm super excited to have her. She's one of the tropical ponies, one of my favorite sets of ponies. And um, wow, the hair, that's, that's super nice. Like she um, has like her first hair color here is um, it's a um, like the fading pink one, which actually like most ponies don't have anymore in pink. Um, it's a super light pink and it most often is super um, faded to white, but this still has a little bit of pink. Uh, it's more pink in um, real life than what I see on the camera. Wow, oh, she's so beautiful. Like it's a set of ponies uh, consisting of four ponies. I have already two of them. So there's a third one. So there's just one missing, which are all themed like tropical summer, you know, fruits and the bold neon colors. And I love them. Like, and what I love especially are their, um, their eyeshadows. Like this one is pink, light pink and yellow eyeshadow. And it has these bright, um, yeah, bright blue and pink striped fish. Oh, I love that one. The hair is a little bit dry, but I can totally work with that. And the rest, like, it, it has still, it's still pink in there. That's great. I think there's just one spot here. Wow, I love it. Okay. Uh, box probably more than one pony in there yeah okay this is the first one I see Ta what do I get in there ah. this is bouquet Ooh, the hair is a mess Ooh, this is like wow my goodness uh, yeah, no. This was a pack uh, package that I also, it's three ponies. I know that there's a fakie in, but like two ponies and I just paid eight euro. So I knew that the quality would be very good. Look at this mess of hair. <laughs> Anyways, it's um, okay. She's from um, a set called the Brush and Grow Ponies. Like in my one of my last hauls, I had a Brush and Grow Princess. So this is like the predecessor concerning uh, this gimmick. Uh, I think there were six ponies in the set. Let's see if it still works. No, it doesn't. Yeah. Okay, that takes some time, but it yeah, it gets back. That's good because the pony itself is really kind of uh, dirty. It's supposed to be white, it's not white at all, but I can totally work with that probably. And the rest is also very neon. I didn't know that she is so neon, like her, her like, <laughs> like whatever hat bonnet, whatever this is here, is also super neon. And as you saw, you can pull out the hair and then turn the head and the hair gets back into the body. Um, <laughs> ah, but she's beautiful. And she's a unicorn. Pony, but not from the first set of rainbow ponies, but from the second set released in year three. Uh, year three means uh, 18, 
84 to 85 and those um, ponies have these like um, like more like let's call it, I don't want to call it dull <laughs> but these other kind of rainbow hair like these like um, coral and then light pink and um, and uh, neon um, yellow and she has got some like, some, like watering cans and she's cute um, ah by the way yes I definitely I kind of knew that but I wasn't exactly sure because the picture didn't really show it uh, I can see that her uh, watering cans they are not glittery normally they should be if uh, they were from the like normal like let's say in North America release uh, probably this one's an Italy version yes Italy <laughs> Other people like from the US were probably so happy like oh wow a rare Nirvana pony and for me it's like oh another Italy pony uh, I'm not mad about that you know like I have one other uh, rainbow pony from the second set which is uh, Pinwheel and she's also Italian so those two Italian girls then can talk in Italian <laughs> but I normally like like them um, when they like them more when they have the glittery symbols but she's still beautiful she is dirty she is very dirty um, I know that often on camera it doesn't look that dirty as it looks in person but um, I love to clean them so that should be totally fine I think that's really just dirt that I can get off very beautiful she's even be more beautiful than what I thought she would be okay mold concerning the body because this looks like an awful lot like the Tootsie Pose. They just made up their own head and I think that's very ugly. The hair is like super like I don't know like I have no idea what I do with this because I it doesn't go into my collection though I still think it's kind of cute or cute than what I thought. Uh, so no idea what I do with it. Maybe I put the super neon hair on it. <laughs> no I don't do that. Um, yeah Traumland Pony Fakey. I don't collect fakies, but it was in the like in the pony lot of these three together. And it's my first fakie. Like I know as a child I had some. Next one. If I look now at my ponies already, if it's only if it's just three, oh my god, I love them. Okay. What's in here? What's in here? A lot of packing. Um, I don't know, I always call them pecking marshmallows. Um, okay, I see, I see, I see something. Couch is making noises, I hope you don't hear that. Okay, this is sugar sweet. Oh, sweet sugar? No, oh, I'm sweet sugar. Sugar sweet. I always mix it up, sweet sugar is it, yeah, that's sweet sugar. She is a pony from one of my favorite sets, 
from the um, candy cane ponies. Uh, currently you can't tell that but uh, she's supposed to have like super like curly like ringlet curls always with two colors uh, together and um, so that it makes like this color swirl with white and then one color like candy cane that's why they're called candy cane ponies like in one of my last hauls I had uh, molasses and um, I really love them and I really want to collect the whole set and all of them are candy themed or sweets themed. This one has got, um, I think it's supposed to be cotton candy on the stick and oh it's so cute. I think this one is the only unicorn from that set and I'm really excited to style her hair. Although I think her hair, like she doesn't have much hair. I don't know how many curls I get out of this one. Maybe three. Let's, let's see. Which is, which is normal. I don't know. I don't know. It feels thin, but I think that's uh, just the way it was, probably. Because there's nothing ripped or anything. Other than that, uh, well, she, she looks good. I think I can style the hair real cute. No, the other way around, sweet sugar. <laughs> What's even more confusing than with this sweet and sugar is that I have another pony in this box. It's also something sweet, um, but it's it doesn't start with sweet, but it starts with sugar, so it's sugar berry. And yeah, this is sugar berry. She is from the Twice as Fancy Pony set, from the first Twice as Fancy Pony set from year. Oh, I always mix that up, but I think it's year 5, so from 86 to 87. These Twice as Fancy Ponies have uh, their symbol or their cutie mark all over their body. Also, the back is covered. And she has super cute strawberries. And her white isn't that white anymore. I don't think I can get her to like complete white. And, and what I knew is that she had like bright pink highlighter marks, which are like kind of impossible to remove. But I really want to collect the whole set. Like the Twice as Fancies are like my favorite. She even has this cute strawberry on her, um, what is this place called? Forehead? Yeah, forehead. And her hair is, oh, it's also neon. I think today is the day of the neon ponies. Oh, I love it. So bright. Um, I think, like oh, with the sugar names, yeah, I think the, the UK version was called um, Strawberry Fair, which makes more sense to me than something again with sugar. But it's a sugar berry to me because I kind of stick to the American names. Oh, she's cute. Just that damn highlighter, but I'm okay with it because it matches up with the hair, right? <laughs> Sugar, sugar berry. There's something else in here? No, just a card, whatever that is. No. No surprise in that box. Okay, next one, the small one here. What's this? Ah. Oh, it is main sale. I don't know if this is supposed to be her body color. Oh, on okay, camera well, it looks good, but in real life it looks kind of greenish. Um, anyways, this is main sale. She is a sunshine pony. And I know that in this haul um, here there will be two other sunshine ponies. I have one already, uh, Sand Digger. And I love them because they are like summer themed, also like beach themed. Um, they have a kind of special gimmick actually that Obviously, probably that's not working anymore, but when they were new, their white streaks in the air uh, of the hair, they color changed when sitting in the sunlight. They changed to pink. And that's also uh, the reason why um, most of their hair 
it's like super fizzy, uh, frizzy at the end. If you see that? It's not nice and it's really impossible to really like style really nicely. But I think the mane still looks okay and I can always do something like if I just do a giant curl here in the end then it will look good and I really really like them. This one has just small sailboats. Spot, but very cute. And by the way, like this pose is like my ultimate favorite pose, the posy pose. There's already two of them in this haul. <laughs> Yeah, except for the ends are dry. Uh, that so that is Sunny Bunch. Not Honey Bunch, Sunny Bunch. She she is a merry-go-round pony, which is easy to recognize for their like sculpted on saddles. They don't have like a cutie mark extra. They have like these saddles and these. It's supposed to be here. Um, this one's with beautiful flowers and very unusual for a pony to have like green hair. I mean not super unusual because I think they have for one other. <laughs> I love that and um, the color combination is also very cute. It's a light pink. Um, I already have like two from this set. I have Brilliant Blossoms and I have Tassels. And I really would like to complete the set, but I think the two or the others that are missing, I think it's a set of six ponies. Um, I think there's one other in this mold, it's white, I don't know the name, uh, which I could be able to find, but then there are two others which are extremely rare, I think, at least in Europe. Uh, I've never seen them, but these are very cute. Merry-go-round ponies. Sometimes I say um, carousel ponies, but merry-go-round ponies. Um, because they look as if they would be on a merry-go-round, you know, where you would sit on and... And again, another one <laughs> in the posing pose. Another one, yeah, there's another one in this. I can't say box because package. What's in here? Something else? No, it feels like that's, that's it. Yeah. Here we have the Pony Bright. I have to say, I already have the Pony Bright, and um, I don't want to, like, it's not one of my favorites, so that I want to have duplicates or something. Um, but there are like two reasons. Like, first reason is my pony bride, it's in a not so good condition. Like, especially because it has tail rust and rust, rust. And the body is really discolored, not really discolored, but kind of. And I thought this one is in a little bit of be better condition, especially because the hair looks better. No tail rust here. And, um, but I plan on doing a project with these because I want to like have two more. Um, because this pose is a kind of unique pose. There weren't many other ponies made in this pose, but they are, there's a set which I will probably never be able to have. They're called Color Squirrel Ponies and um, they were never released in Europe. So I've never seen them online to, uh, to purchase at all. I want to try to recreate them uh, to 
customize them, like to cosplay, <laughs> to make this pony uh, a cosplayer of another kind of pony. At least I want to try. That's why I now have like a pony bride that's in a better condition. So I will keep this as my pony bride and then the other one I will customize. Um, what else can I say about the pony bride? It's a single release from year nine, I think, or even or eight. Um, so more of the late 80s um, and it is supposed to be a pony that marries someone so it has like two doves and the rings and it came with a bunch of accessories like a wedding cake and stuff like that and it is a very nice mold very very cute bright white with the tinsel hair Sunshine ponies. Yay. I can show you them to you. Oof, oof, oof. This is Wave Runner and this is Beach Ball. Remember Sunshine ponies? That's this one, the color changing streak in his hair. These two are as well. Um, and again, like this white is super frizzy and not very nice, but I have rarely ever seen sunshine ponies with um, super good hair condition because it just it just happens to that color changing hair um, that it gets very frizzy and very uh, not very nice but as I said I really like those ponies uh, because of their beach and, and summer theme so this one has like bubbles and uh, uh, seahorses all over its body and this one is like uh, it's called beach ball and has beach balls <laughs> and some stars and um, what I really like about them is like they their cutie marks are like all over the body it's kind of same as with the twice as fancy ponies although they're not belonging in the twice as fancy line but um, I really love that so I now have four of the sunshine ponies and um, yeah the hair is uh, going to be a little bit more difficult to style nicely but let's see what I can achieve Great. Now let's get to the giant box over here. Oof. It's the last one, the last, the very last thing, uh, the very last box is then another pony. This has actually been one of my grail ponies. Not for, for a very long time because I didn't know she existed. But uh, some weeks ago I checked on all the pony sets available, blah, blah, blah. And I found out that um, the candy cane ponies, like this one, you know, with the um, curly candy cane kind of hair, also had this pony in their line. That's Lemon Treats. And I'd never seen the, her before. Uh, it, that's because she also was never released in Europe. She is, I think, the rarest one of the set. And I'm so happy that I saw her on eBay, like all of those ponies are bought on eBay, different auctions. And I think this one was also the most expensive of all of them here. I paid 20 euro 
for this one but um, like as I said like this color combination with this green that's like said like green pony hair like green and ponies in general is not very common and like she like immediately like her name is lemon treats and she immediately um, um, re like immediately made me think of um, key lime pie she has a slice of, of pie or of cake here um, and uh, like the name lemon treats I, I really really like key lime pie <laughs> ever since we've been to Key West um, she reminds me of that and she's so cute like she has some ugly spots over on this side but anyways from here this is not the display size so this is the display size so I'm totally happy with her like look at this girl now I have um, three of the candy cane ponies and uh, yeah I want to complete this set definitely ponies are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 if you count the Kopeki. Um, okay. I think this is my biggest pony haul ever, like especially like online pony haul. There was one convention where I bought I think the same amount of ponies, but that's not usual. As you can see, it's not a pony. It is a swan. It is a keeper. It's a baby keeper swan from uh, the company Tonka. Also made in the late 80s, I think 87 this one. Um, i just always confused but those, they also have names. They're also like characters. So this one is called Belle, like Belle from Beauty and the Beast Belle. <laughs> um, and uh, she's very cute. I don't know if I can uh, get this off? Probably not. Um, yeah, she is from the second set actually. So the first set um, was released um, also with Belle, but she had like some short hair, like just a small short curl. And um, this one has the glittery eyes, so that's for sure from the second release. So, so cute. Like my, my keepers collections also slowly but steady growing. I think I have now three, four, four small keepers and one big one. And to be honest, the big ones are actually so big that I would not know <laughs> where to display them. Um, okay, that's very cute. about all of those like this um, was bought over the course of I don't know two or three weeks so that was stacking up um, all the packages and now they are finally opened I'm so happy and I'm so happy to get into um, like cleaning them and making the hair so yeah if you um, enjoyed the video um, give it a like and um, if you want to tell me anything, like you can't in these comments, but you can go over to my Instagram, like low uh, sky painter toys, and um, write whatever you want to tell me about these ponies, <laughs> or whatever you want to tell me uh, in there. Um, what's my favorite? Maybe I can tell you what's my favorite. That's so difficult. Like lemon treats is my favorite for like the reason that it is actually the rarest, probably. But color-wise, I'm so into sea breeze. Gosh, I don't know. I love all of them. My goodness. Sugar berry. I even like shrinkles more than I would have what I thought I would. Because her hair is also so cute. Oh, I don't know. No idea. No idea. <laughs> so, 
So, thank you for watching. See you real soon and may the force be with you. Bye!